Now, I typically don't run stuff like this, uh, you know, videos like this with the whole cheater and hacker and blah, 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 you know, on the title. Um, typically, you know, it's used by people that like to do clickbait, you know, shit like that just to promote, you know, Golden Bullet. Oh, you're a cheater. No, he's running Golden Bullet. You're just trying to get clicks. But in this one, I'm doing an exotic uh, com component farm in Dark Zone West. And right as I get to the very last exotic component chest in Dark Zone West, I get jumped by three rogue agents, okay? All three of them, part of the same clan, and they're clearly just trying to kill me and take my stuff. But what they didn't know is I was running my armor region god build. And well, let, let's just, here, I'll show you a quick clip real quick. Just just watch this. Yeah. yeah, no. This guy has way too much survivability to be in this game. He's cheating. Wait a minute. 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 I got a pop of med kit. What the hell? Hostile defender drone detected. And if I die, you have to kill him. I'm not sorry. I can't kill him though. His regen is so good. Now that is only a taste of a 10 minute engagement where I go up against these three rogue agents that just could not kill me. Um, I'll show you all of the footage after this build breakdown so that you can see, you know, have your popcorn ready and, you know, get, get your giggles on because it is pretty damn funny. Um, like halfway through the engagement, they're just like, we can't kill him. What do we do? What do we do? And one of, one of their teammates goes and gets a mortar build. And I'll show you that where they're shooting mortars at me and I kill the guy using the mortars. And he's like, oh, they're cheating. They're cheating. And it's hilarious. I can't wait for you guys to see that gameplay after this build breakdown, but I did die at the very, very end because the guy that I killed with that mortar build came back out with a status effects uh, burn sticky build, and then they finally got me with the foam and the burn sticky. Um, but yeah, uh, I don't, <laughs> if you know these people in the gameplay, shout them out, G give them a big holler. They're on Xbox. I, I don't know what they were thinking. Um, they, they jumped me while I was doing my exotic component farm. I was on the very last chest and I was about to just go extract and move on, but, um, they wanted to have some fun. So fun we had, but before we get into the gameplay, let me show you the build breakdown, shall we? Here we go. So this is my armor region god build that I kind of tweaked a little bit since the last time I showed you, okay? Now the last time I showed you, it was just the king breaker and the vector. Well, what I did is I changed it. I took off the EMP sticky and I put on a bulwark shield with the regulus. And now this thing is so unkillable. It like like you just heard from them live. They're just like, "What do we do? It's survivability's too high." And that's rightfully so because this thing is amazing. I love this build. And if you know anything about me, if I tell you I love this build, I know for a fact that you will love this build too. And it, it has everything you need. It has damage. It has a decoy to get them off your back. It has amplified damage even more. It has a pistol big shield build just in case you get into a pickle. You could throw out that big shield and let your armor region come back while they're shooting that shield. I mean, this thing has it all. It's a running gun uh, through and through build. It is a tank build. However, it does have a lot of that amplified damage. Uh, I, don't, I don't know what else to say about this. It's amazing. It's not even maxed out, and it's probably one of the best Dark Zone builds I've ever put together, period, point blank. All right, now let's uh, let's go ahead and just get, get to it, okay? They're all freaking out because of this right here. I'm sitting at over 110,000 armor region per second. Now, I've already shown this setup before. However, what I did is I changed it, and I put the Regulus and the Big Shield on to increase my survivability even more further because what I was noticing is just running and gunning with an EMP sticky. It was fun and it did increase my survivability pretty high. However, 
popping out the big shield with the pistol will make whoever's shooting you freak out. You'll see in the gameplay where I have three agents shooting me at once. I whip out this big shield and they don't know what to do. They're trying to st uh, they're trying to foam me. They're trying to run behind me. They're they're trying to throw grenades at me, and it's just not working. And then as soon as that shield is getting low in health, I put it away. I combat roll. I run around the building, pop my decoy, and then all of a sudden I'm at max armor and I'm ready to fight again. This thing is insane. If you are running in the dark zone and you think you're going to be by yourself at all, put this on. I promise you, you will love it. You won't just like it. You won't be like, oh yeah, it's, it's okay, it's okay. No, you will love this build. You can open up DZ crates while enemies are all shooting you, and you'll still survive. You'll still open up the crate and be just fine. You can run through heroic landmarks while they are all shooting you and still survive. That's how much survivability is in this build right cheer. Right cheer? This thing right cheer might be one of the best dark zones ever uh, best dark zone build ever made. One of them at least. This is going to be on that Mount Rushmore of dark zone builds to have in your, you know, your collection. This might not be the best of the best of the best sir with honors, but I promise you this is one of them. <laughs> I promise. Anyways, let's talk about it. Starting with the specialization, we are using the technician specialization. The reason being is I want that linked laser pointer. I'm using it on both of my weapons, my primary and my secondary. The reason being is my king breaker is my primary. Perfect flatline. You cannot do anything better than that. 20% amplified damage just off the rip. Not only that, but I'm running it with Spotter, which is another 15% amplified damage. So just by having it in my hand and aiming the weapon, I have 40% amplified damage. Now for 35% amplified damage, I can whip out the Vector 45 ACP. Again, this one with normal flatline and then that linked laser pointer for the underbarrel rail. Now what I added to this is the Regulus. I added the Regulus to this because I was noticing that once they start throwing like stinger hives and sticky bombs and all of that crap at me, once they start throwing the kitchen sink at me, I need something to help, you know, give me a little buffer. And this is what my buffer is. I'm using the Regulus with the Bulwark Shield, and it is a perfect combination to this armor region build because just say like a a heavy or like a boss or something like that is shooting you just head on and you're trying to take care of all the smaller enemies well you can turn around pop out your bulwark shield and while that named boss or whatever is shooting that shield your normal armor will just start you know doop 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 coming right back because of this armor region 110k armor region per second without the memento bag is so, so strong. It is ridiculously strong. I, I can't tell you enough that your survivability is cranked up past 11 with this build. Now, the other thing is using the decoy. That is key, especially when you have multiple agents trying to fire at you at the same time. So like you'll see in the gameplay, I'll have all three of those rogue agents shooting me at once. I'll pop the decoy, run around the corner, and all of a sudden you'll see two out of the three people shooting my decoy. It, it works. It works really, really well, especially if they're using auto-aim. All right, so that is the weapons, specialization, and the skills. Let's talk about the build, all right? Now, the build is all about the Ninja Bike Messenger Bag. Without the Ninja Bike Bag, you would not be able to put this build together. Now, what makes this build, or this backpack, so special for the build is it comes with all three core attributes. So it helps out everything on your build. It helps out your shield, it helps out your armor, and it helps out your damage. Now, for the talent, this is what really cranks this thing to 11. So resourceful. It'll slot in with any brand set or gear set to fulfill a set bonus. So, for example, I have two Foundry Bulwark with the Ninja Bike. That makes it three. The Murakami, that makes it two Murakami, two Golden Gear, and two Bellstone Armory. Now, I do not need the two Murakami, but... The real reason I'm using that is for the double armor region, and we'll talk about that here in a second. But you can understand why the Ninja Bike is so special. 
because I'm using three Foundry, two Golan, two Bellstone, and two Murakami just on the same build. It, it's ridiculous. You would not be able to do this without the Ninja Bike. Now, with that being said, let's jump into the other items. Bellstone Armory Mask. Now, what's cool about this is with the Ninja Bike, I also get that armor on kill, which also helps out my survivability. Because remember, just by killing, like, say, their skills or something like that, you can proc that armor on kill as well because it is considered a kill, whether it be a skill kill or a weapon or agent kill. Now, as far as the brand set um, bonuses, armor region, 1%, 10% armor on kill. The attributes, we have max armor, max armor region, and then max crit chance with a max crit chance mod. Going to the chess piece, we have golden gear. Now, this is my golden gear chess piece with spotter. I chose spotter over unbreakable because I felt that the survivability was already enough and I needed to have more damage. Now, having that extra 15% amplified damage really does help out, especially when they're trying to face tank you and you can get those headshots in. It really does help to have that extra amplified damage on your side. Now, Unbreakable isn't bad. However, instead of using Unbreakable, I do have that shield. So whenever my armor gets low, instead of relying on Unbreakable to proc, I just whip out my shield and let my armor regen do the talking. Um, as far as the Golden Gear brand set bonuses, 10% status effects and 1% armor regen. Going to the two pieces of Foundry Bulwark, starting with the gloves, Foundry Bulwark gear set bonuses, we get 10% total armor, 1% armor regen, and then 50% shield health. So now we have a stronger shield where we weren't even using that before, but now we are, and man, does that really help out the survivability and overall sustainability of this build? As far as the attributes, max armor, max armor region. For the foundry holster, max armor, max armor region. And then the last piece of the puzzle, the creme de la creme, the hardest named item to get, the emperor's guard knee pads with double region. Now, what do I mean by double region? Well, we have the 1% armor region as an attribute, and then we have the max armor region as another attribute. Now, with that, I rolled armor for the core attribute, and then we're good to go. Now, as far as the Murakami brand set bonuses, we get skill duration and repair skills, but we're not using either one of those. And there you go. There's the build. This is my Dark Zone Armor Region God build, you know, the Ninja Bike Region God build, whatever you want to call it. But, you know, it's safe to say that the survivability is really ridiculously high with this one. I don't know. Let's uh, finish up the stats. This is for your King Breaker. 104k on that weapon damage, 41.5k for PvP. Uh, we're at 44 crit chance, 55 crit damage, and 75 headshot with health damage, and then don't forget about the damage targets at a cover. Offensive tab, we're sitting at 47% all weapons damage bonus and 30% AR damage bonus. So every time we're using the King Breaker, we are starting off at 77% damage bonus total. Gear talents, I am using resourceful on the backpack and spotter on the chest piece. For my defensive tab, we are over uh, 2.1 million armor. We are at 213k armor on kill, 110k armor regen per second, and we are over 342k health. For the explosive resistance and hazard, both of them are at 10%, and that's due to my watch level. So here is my disclaimer for all my build videos. I am currently at shade level 4,714. That means all these boxes are maxed out 50 of 50. So if you are at or above shade level 1,000 and you copy and paste my build, you should get the exact same numbers and results. However, if you are below shade level 1,000 and you copy and paste my build, some of these boxes are not going to be maxed out. Therefore, some of your numbers won't be as high. Don't freak out. It is still an incredible build, I promise you. Try it out, but just note that by the time you hit shade level 1000, you will get the most potential out of your build. So it's not a requirement to hit shade level 1000. I'm just recommending that way you can get the most bang for your buck. But all right, everyone, that is it. This is my, I mean, 
This is easily one of my best Dark Zone builds in the game. I hope you enjoy the gameplay and get a little laugh, but I get jumped by three players and, well, they weren't really expecting this. Let's just go ahead and roll that footage. Hit the like, subscribe, you know the whole spiel. I'm Kamikaze Von Doom, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everyone, and happy hunting. Peace. Now roll that footage. Yo, they can't even kill me, man. With a landmark on me, guys. Come on, who are these people? SSS. Hold on, we have SSS Kellogg's, SSS Zombie, and SSS, who's the other guy? Zombie Kellogg, God Rack. These three guys, look at this. I'm able to read your names while you are jumping me during a landmark. Look at this, they can't even. <laughs> Yeah, pull out the foam. That's not gonna do anything. Oh, 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 they got me here? They got me here? Nope, nope, they didn't. Yo, I could do this all day, man. Dude, the shield. They couldn't get through the shield. Oh my God, I loved it. All right, switch back. But then you can see my armor was right back. Oh my gosh, this is ridiculous. All three of them. That, that guy just got caught taking a photo. Oh my gosh. Oh, now they have one person. Oh, no, nope, all three of them are still on me. They have a healer. Oh, they're shooting my decoy. Okay. Dude, come on, just give up. Just give up. What are you doing? You're not gonna kill me. Give up. Oh my gosh, with the foam, with the foam. Got me. Nope. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Really? Come on. Yo, I'm fast as fuck, boy. I'm fast as fuck. Oh. Where are you going? I'm fast as fuck. <laughs> How long have we been doing this? They still can't kill me, man. Oh my gosh. All three of them. All three of them. You look ridiculous. You look ridiculous. Come on. Look at this. <laughs> Come on. There are three of you. And I have NPCs at my back. What is going on here? Oh my gosh. Oh, more foam. Oh, oh, you gonna get me? Nope. Keep it going. Jeez, dude. I have some goodies on my bag. Ouch, 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 ouch. Oop. Nope. Still kinda get it. Yo, this guy's using a double barrel sawed off to my face. And they still can't kill me. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Ring around the rosy, get my armor back. There we go. Oh, they have this guy clearing the landmark now. Yo, the other two guys are still at my back. What is going on here? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Before this is over, I'm killing at least one of them. Before this is over. I'm, I'm, I'm saying it right now. I'm claiming it. Oh, he's trying to heal up. Come on. Go around. Around town. Go, go, go. Dude. We are going to be at this all day. I'm telling you. Now there's only a few more NPCs left. Oh, they're clearing the uh, landmark now. Maybe they're getting sick of getting shot by ads. Even though they're going up against me. <laughs> what is going on here? This is crazy right now. Why did you guys even pop rogue on me? Honestly. What, what's going on here? Oh, you cleared it for me. Hey, thanks. Thanks for the uh, landmark clear. I appreciate you, brother. All right, now that I have all three of you on me, let's see what happens. Oh, this guy's build is insane, dog. <laughs> what? Dude, he's crazy. I can't cheat up. No, no, now I'm being called a yeah, cheater. No. This guy has way too much survivability to be in this game. He's got a bit cheating. Oh, man. Um, Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I, I can't, I can't kill you, therefore, he must be cheating. <laughs> Yeah, you better heal up, bro. Yeah. You better heal up. Yeah, you better heal up. I'm telling you. This region is so good. Oh. Oh my gosh. Come on. This guy's cheating, though. This game is ruined by people like this. Oh, I'm ruining the game. I'm ruining it. This is why no. Oh no, my gosh, come on. Like come on, come on, come on, come on. This is why no one plays this game with you. This is why no
No one plays the game. Like these, these stupid builds that are mm. like broken and shit. Bro. Like this is broken? Like oh, this isn't broken. There's no damage, bro. There's no damage. Yeah, no damage. Like, How am I flipped. taking no damage? Oh, oh. It's gonna be mortar turret, That's mortar turret. Oop, mortar turret. <laughs> oh my god. Mortar turret. Yeah, yeah, come back over here, you skill build. Come back, come back. Uh, I'll get the skill build. These guys yeah, are trying me. He's just sucked up in my boots for some reason. Mm. <laughs> yeah, come on. We can't kill him. Like, he's running around a bit. Oh, oh you just missing your boots. Whoa, 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 kill him. <laughs> Go, get him. Oh, 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 got him. Got him. Oh, my God. Got him. I'm clipping that. Yeah, I clipped it too. Got him. Got him. <laughs> Got him. Ah! Yo. Uh, no. Not gonna kill me. They're not gonna Spam, kill me. You gotta use like the craziest status build to kill me or something. You're, you're not know, doing man. it. No unbreakable. I don't need unbreakable. Oh, here we go. Yes. Uh oh. Oh! Oh, there it is. Status build. Yep. He got me. He got me. He got me. He got me right here. He got me. He got me. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. GG's. GG's. Oh, give me all that. I'm very sorry. I'm very sorry, Kamikaze. Dude, that thought your region build was overpowered, but... Maybe just yeah, no, the game. Oh, he does just have a hundred thousand region. <laughs> Kamikaze, bro. And poisoned. He would have survived that power sticky. That skill. is unfortunate. It's a wild skill. Really good build.